A great general once prefaced his writings on the history of warfare with the comment, I have not written this book to glorify war. I have sought to highlight the human endeavor of men and women which is brought out in wartime. Montgomery of Alamein, 1968. So with this series, The Amazing World of War Machines, we shall not glorify war, but highlight the ingenuity and flexibility of the human mind in overcoming the theoretical and technical challenges of the times. The history of the machines of war, albeit the history of armed conflict, is intrinsically tied to the history of civilization and man's quest for the basics in life. From the dawn of time, people have endured conflict and in so doing discovered the value of technological advantage. The army most likely to be victorious on the battlefield would be the army with the edge in tactics, delivered by a technological advantage in weaponry. Time and again, the better bow and arrow won the day. The Assyrians had the battlefield superiority with their chariots, able to take advantage of the flat desert terrain. Defeated armies almost always learnt their lessons and, as a result, usually adopted the tactic or technology that had defeated them. This levelling of the battlefield would then lead to further breakthroughs in technology to regain the upper edge. In response to the chariot, the composite bow was perfected by the Egyptians. With its added strength and elasticity, it gave archers greater range and power. The Egyptians also eventually adopted the chariot. In defense of superior arrows, the Sumerians developed armor, cloaks studded with small circular metal pieces and larger shields, which the Romans used to create the phalanx. Methods to overcome the phalanx were explored and so on through the ages. One-upmanship was the name of the game of warfare and survival. Other stepping stones included the Roman gladius, or short sword, made from carbon steel. The English longbow, the trebuchet, and chain mail. But one technological development superseded all before it in one single stroke, or more appropriately, one single flash. Deep within the mists of mythology and forgotten history lies the origin of gunpowder, better known as black powder. <laughs> 